Hi, welcome to QBox. In this QBox Quick Tips and Tricks, we'll show you how to open, lock, and sync QuickBooks company files. Before beginning, you'll want to ensure you have the QBox Explorer installed on your computer, and there's a company file in your shared sync folder. When it's time to work on your company file, you're just going to double click to open up the folder. Here's my local QuickBooks file, so I'm just going to double click. And it's like initializing any other company file on your computer. So it's going to open up the QuickBooks application as well as that actual company file. As you know, QBox only allows one person to work in a company file at a time. And how we control that is with a locking mechanism. Once you log into the company file, the next prompt you're going to see is this lock request. This is the most important part of QBox. It's asking you do you want to lock the company file, which is essentially asking you are you going to work. If you will work in the company file or make any changes, you always say yes. If you just wanted to go into the file, maybe look at some historical information, run reports, but not make any changes, you would say no. Right now I am going to work, so I'm going to say yes, I want to lock it. And after I say yes, it gives me confirmation. Just so you know, as soon as you lock the company file, if I jump back to my cue box, you'll now see I have a lock icon with my email address. So that's real-time information between your staff and your clients to see who's actively working in that company file. Back on my end, it's a local copy of QuickBooks. I can do anything I normally do. Once I'm done working and I want to sync the file and release the lock, all I have to do is close out of the company file. So you can go to File, Close Company, or if you're done working in QuickBooks for the day, you're just going to File and Exit. You'll notice the pop-up on the bottom right-hand corner of my desktop up here. And then down in the bottom green border of my QBox Explorer, you'll see a sync message as well as a percent. That is my file, just syncing up those incremental changes up to the cloud. Once it's in the cloud, the file becomes unlocked, and you'll notice that the lock icon with my email address has disappeared in my QBox Explorer. My changes are then synced over to my other shared users so that they have the latest version of the file on their computer. After that sync process is completed, they can then open and lock the file and start working on their end. And that wraps it up for our QBox quick tips and tricks. Be sure to like and subscribe.